Hi, we're at the Combined Naval Event 2025 in Farnborough, UK. I am with John Clark, campaign manager at Leonardo for the Proteus project. And we're actually standing on a full-scale model of that future uh, VTOL UAV uh, system for the Royal Navy. And uh, we're going to find out more about uh, this project. John, good morning. Thanks for uh, welcoming us in front of that uh, nice uh, model. Can you please first tell us about uh, the World Proteus project? What is it about? So the Proteus project is aimed at providing evidence for the Royal Navy that an uncrewed air system can deliver or contribute to, to the delivery of military maritime capability. That involves three main activities. Uh, we've delivered a comprehensive evidence pack to the Royal Navy. We are building, uh, manufacturing at the moment, a uh, a full, full, full flight model and it also involves the demonstration in a synthetic environment of maritime effect, the primary one being ASW find. So that will be the main uh, mission of uh, the Proteus the primary system? The mission that the Navy wish to deliver is ASW find using multi-static sonar boys. Any other secondary mission sets? We have a comprehensive list of missions. I think there's about 16 altogether, but it covers everything from ASW with uh, sonar boys, consideration of whether we can get a dipping sonar in, uh, comprehensive surveillance suite, logistics, so a full range of uh, maritime capabilities. Can you share with us uh, some of the performance figures and uh, main specifications of the aircraft? Certainly. So the technology demonstrator is a three-ton aircraft. Uh, we're expecting to, to achieve in a production variant a payload fraction of better than 50%. So we expect to have at least 1,500 kilos of payload. That can be used for maritime payloads or additional fuel and we expect to fly for eight to ten hours. We need to get airborne for long enough to um, make sure that we're not always flying back to the ship and therefore impacting deck tempo on the ship. And uh, John, on the in, in Royal Navy service, on which uh, vessels will uh, Proteus go? So our primary target is the Type 26, um, but we are also expecting to fly from Royal Fleet Auxiliaries from the carriers, um, potentially OPVs, but yeah, Type 26 is the primary target for this platform. Lastly, John, uh, today we're in May 2025. What's the current status for uh, the project? So as I said earlier, the, we are currently manufacturing uh, a full-scale aircraft, and that is expected to fly in quarter three this year. All right. Very well. Thank you very much. Pleasure. Thank you.